Hey you guys, this is Tyler or Explicify here. I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know that I am going for the phase five. I never really like to join teams, to be honest. A lot of teams that I do end up joining are really small and through my experience they all end pretty quickly i've only been kicked from one team and it was because they're strictly clips they don't really like content creators and i, I don't know they just didn't really like you know playing the game they like to have really complex trick shots every week so they can come out with team tosses and stuff and that just wasn't my style so they ended up releasing me of course i was going to leave anyways eventually phase means a lot more to me than a lot of the smaller teams and I'll tell you why. I started watching FaZe Clan in 2011. I was 12 years old. I had just gotten onto YouTube and I started watching a lot of Lego videos, believe it or not. I used to watch a lot of Lego stop motion, World War II Lego stop motion, things like that. I also watched a lot of Star Wars stop motion. I'm a huge Star Wars fan, if you didn't know. Anyways, I'm getting sidetracked here. But after all the Lego videos, I started watching walkthroughs of gameplays. I watched some PewDiePie. Um, and then PewDiePie led me to Call of Duty. And then I got Call of Duty 2 and started playing that. And I looked up walkthroughs for Call of Duty 2. And of course, by that time, Modern Warfare 2 was already out. So FaZe Clan was already uploading. I do remember I saw FaZe Clan in the suggested box down near a walkthrough for Call of Duty 2. And I clicked on the video and I just subscribed immediately. Since then, I've had three different YouTube channels, two of them before I never uploaded on. Well, except one, but you guys will never find that one. <laughs> but on all three channels, I went back and specifically subscribed to them. And when I made this channel, I specifically went and subscribed to them as the first subscription for this YouTube channel because they mean that much to me. Ever since I was 12 and I'm 21 now, I have been watching FaZe Clan. Of course, it started out on the team channel and then I branched out. First FaZe member I started watching was FaZe Apex. Shout out to you, Apex. I don't know if Apex remembers me at all, but if he does end up watching this video, Apex shouted me sense. out back in 2015, the summer of 2015. Me, so. Some guy just tweeted at me saying, I hit Mark with the window shot in your game. Credit. Poor guy, watch this. No! Explicify. Why? Let's see who we hit. Faded Orbits? Yep, hit market faded orbits. I'm sorry, Explicify. Guys, sub him. Look at his emblem. Explicify, that's his YouTube channel. Poor guy just hit market the window shot, dude. He deserves a sub. Thank right. you a lot for that, Apex. It means the world to me. But just to get noticed by someone of that level, of that caliber at that time, meant the world to me. Quite literally, FaZe Clan has been with me throughout all of my teenage years. Ever since middle school, all the way through high school, and I'm a junior in college now. So they've been at the front of my whole teenage years at this point. And I can't imagine my teenage years any different than going onto YouTube and looking up FaZe Ill Cams or looking for Apex's new video or turning on notifications for Apex and Blaziken and Temper, getting that notification at school and waiting for class to be over so I could watch the video real quick in between my classes. I just admire the team so much and everything that they've accomplished. At that time, I had been going through a lot of really hardships in my life. I had lost a dog. I was kind of getting depressed. It was the middle of high school and I didn't really have many friends. After Apex shouted me out that year, everybody wanted to be my friend. But I stayed true to who I was and I kept some of my friends that I was semi close with and now we're as close as can be. And that's all because of FaZe Clan and what they did for me and how they built up my confidence throughout the years. And no matter what, I have stuck with them. When they transferred from doing the old fashioned trick shotting to some stuff that was more complex, I stuck with them. I'm doing the phase five for me. I love doing it. And that's kind of the whole point. And I feel like a lot of the community, a lot of the gaming community kind of lost sight of that. Of course, all the other small channels will agree with me. You know, you start out and you really love it and you just want to keep going. Eventually though, you lose motivation, you lose video ideas. I even went to basic combat training, joined the military, and I wasn't able to upload for four months. I came back and started that upload streak again, and then I got really discouraged and stopped uploading. But I'm really motivated now. I just want to keep uploading and entertaining as many people as possible, keep growing my channel. Right now we're close to 2,200 subscribers, so that's crazy. Thank you guys for that. I can't believe how far we've come in my little community that I've built here. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed me talking and phase up forever, everybody. Have a great day. Peace out.